Okay, Lauren, thanks very much. Even though Baltimore City is continuing to tighten restrictions on social gatherings, more students in the city will head back to their classrooms this morning. 27 of the city's public schools will reopen for small groups of students. WMR 2 News Mark Roper is live outside Reginald F. Lewis High School in Northeast Baltimore with more on who's going back to school today. Mark. Yeah, good morning, Christian. These are students of all ages that for one reason or another, virtual learning at home has been or is difficult for them. So the school system is opening up 25 buildings or 27 schools in all to make those students a priority so they can keep up with their studies. As of today, Monday, November 16th, Baltimore City Schools will reopen more than two dozen schools to a variety of students. These are students prioritized as early or young learners, kindergarten students, students who are in the transition grades between elementary elementary and middle school or middle school and high school students in grades six and nine, as well as students whose studies require hands-on education, such as CTE, career and technical education students. Now, school system officials also believe opening these schools will help homeless students, students with disabilities, or students who are also learning English as a second language. The reopening of these schools comes as the number of COVID cases continues to climb and more restrictions on social gatherings in Baltimore are put in place, and it has leaders with the teachers' union concerned, while the city school CEO insists the school buildings are safe. We shouldn't be talking about schools reopening right now. We should be talking about safety survival. Now, the Baltimore City Schools CEO says they are ready to welcome back more students and says the school system spent millions of dollars buying cleaning supplies and personal protective equipment for its employees. We are live in Northeast Baltimore. Mark Roper, WMAR 2 News. Okay.